welcome to vlogmas day 11. I didn't even bother record me making my tea or my breakfast this morning because I'm panicking. I think it's pretty obvious at this point. I just spent most of my days panicking about how much I have to do, so I'm not even gonna go on about it. So for you guys, yesterday two videos went up. Please go and check them out. So my Mickey just arrived that I ordered yesterday. I didn't have time to go and get Mickey memories yesterday. I ordered them online and he came about an hour ago, but I was just finishing up my videos and my emails and stuff. So I'm gonna quickly unbox this for you because I haven't even seen them yet. And then my little brother is off school again. So he's already rang us, bless him, he's got his first mobile phone. He's already rang us and he wants us to go around and see him again. I want to so bad. Like, I wish I didn't have so much to do or I wish I'd like had, oh, I don't even know, but I'd just love to go and watch Christmas movies with him and hang out with him, bless him. Me and mom's house is really cozy right now because it's got the tree up and everything and it's not a mess like my house. I feel so bad, like, I don't know, I don't know. I really don't want to spend any more money at Costa, but I know he likes a Costa. So I don't know whether to just say to him, do you want to like literally come out to the car, I'll take you through the drive through get you a coffee and then just drop you back off home. Like I, I really just don't have time to sit with him. I feel terrible. But at the same time, I don't want to keep buying coffee. So I don't know whether to just ring him and say I can't come around today, but I feel so bad. Right, anyway, stop thinking out loud, Sarah. Mickey came. Obviously, I got Mickey memories, the plush and the cup. I don't get the pins. So I'm very excited to see this. Oh, he's shiny. Oh, wow. He feels different to what I thought. He's a lot, he's a lot softer than what I thought. He does have a lot of marks on him. I guess that's just the fabric. Yeah, he definitely feels a lot different to what I thought. Almost loose. The fabric is like loose. It's weird. Like he's not stuffed or something. Oh, his tail is very weird. 12 of 12 i can't believe it i can't believe we've finished i can't believe i got them all i can't believe i got them all it is a bit a bit weird inside because like i ordered this one online and i guess one of the things was going and seeing everybody every month and yeah even just seeing the cast members they always know that i go through and if i'm ever late they're like oh we're wondering where you were like the dead canny and yeah this month i had to order online but I got him. So yeah, here he is. He is very shiny. Ooh, Lordy. He's really shiny. I do really like the fact that they finished off number 12 with a quote on number 12. Because obviously January has a quote. I think I complained every month that I wanted another quote on one of the, like all of the plushes to be honest. And I wanted it to match in the cup. But number 12 does have it on. So there's 12 of 12. He's really like iridescent shiny. I don't know what era he's supposed to be. October was 2000 to 2010. November was 2010 to 20. Which I also don't get because it's very like... Well, I do get it. There's not really much about this decade, is there? So he was very like plain, like coffee colours. Just kind of like muted grey and stuff. So I get that. I do. So he's 2020 to 30. We don't know what the future is. This is the future. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, they haven't really explained to have the on the Instagram. I don't know. But regardless, I do really like him. He does have a couple of like marks on him. I guess it's just like the fabric. Can you see? It doesn't bother me. It's really not that bad. I guess it's it's just the fabric. You can kind of see it all over. Quote says it's kind of fun to do the impossible Walt Disney. Yeah, I really like him. I think he's a really nice addition. I know my little brother wanted this one. Um, I got him August. He actually wants the cup more than he wanted the plush this month. So I think I'm taking, oh wow. Oh wow. Oh my God, this cup's amazing. Anyway, I think I'm taking my little brother to Metro Center on Monday because he's finished school. Hopefully he'll be feeling better by then. And we're gonna go for a Yo Sushi because he's never had one. And on Mondays it's a bit cheaper. And I think I'm going to get him this cup for Christmas. He's technically already had his Christmas present, but I don't mind getting him another one. Oh my god, the quote is in the cup as well. I'm happy. I'm happy. So this is the cup in the box. Obviously, it's all like light blue and everything. Wow, this cup is beautiful. It's also squint. The handle's on. Squinty. Is that my eyes? No, it definitely is. Is it? It's like the bottom of the handle is sticking out a little bit. I don't know if it's my eyes. Anyway, as long as it stacks, I'm good. So because of where I'm sat, it's a bit hard to show you. But can you see that there's like little 
mickeys all over that little you can't see that can you let me just change the lighting a little bit can you see those little mickeys like all over and then it's kind of like white iridescent -y with like the diamonds on and then inside is like a light blue and then there's the quote please ignore my chip nail varnish it needs taken off so bad 12 of 12 we got there in the end i like them i really do yeah i do i like them i like the cup it's very elsa very frozen very like cold december -y, freezy snow which is very appropriate right now so i'll use that in the morning and yeah i guess i'll go and put him up with the other 12. quite honestly i have no idea how to get that up there because normally I stand on the bed, but it's quite a way over. So I think I'm just going to try and throw them up and then Matthew will have to help me later. Also, those are not just random nails sticking out. There was a pair of E's in there, but I'm trying to reorganise them at the minute, so I need to put some back in. Okay, I know the angle's weird, but it's the best I can do. Alright, let's try and get them up. <laughs> That's the best I can do. Okay, so November and December are not up properly. <laughs> But look at my Mickey memories. I'm so glad I managed to get all 12. Like, I'm so happy. And that is that done. That is 2018. Wow. What a year for Mickey. So I feel absolutely terrible about not being able to hang out with my little brother. Yeah, so I'm going to take him for a coffee. This is the greatest song ever made. Ever. Where is he? Come on, Chopsy. Oh no, I th you're coming straight out. I'm on, I'm on time scale. <laughs> right, okay. Right. Oh, bless him. He was like, well, I was going to let you in for a minute. I really don't have time. I feel so bad. I've been sat here waiting for him that long. I turned the car off so I didn't waste my petrol. And I've had to turn it back on because I'm absolutely freezing. It's so cold. Where is he? What is he doing? Where is he? What is he doing? This kid, honestly. He's 12. Like, put some... I don't know. What do 12-year-olds wear these days? God knows. You haven't got your shoes on. <laughs> what are you doing? Right, okay, bye. Bye. What is he doing? He hasn't even got his shoes on. I'm gonna kill him. Oh, movement, movement. Here he comes. Here he comes to wreck the day. Come along, tops. What have you been doing? Getting ready. <laughs> Getting ready? I feel a bit better today. Good. Shall we go and get a pasta? Yeah. Let's go. Do you know what you want? Uh, like a latte with cream. Just a latte, not a gingerbread one. Just a standard latte, with a medium standard latte with cream. Is this on? I don't know if it's a pasta, what can I get for you? Can I get a latte, please? A medium size? Yeah. But can I get one? cream put on it? Cream on top, yeah? Yes, please. Do you want a sweetie uh, cake or anything? Is that a yes? Uh, Sorry, I'm just, I'm just deciding. Oh, no. Um, could I have a cheese, cheese and ham toasty? And can I get a cheese and ham toasty, please? Cheese and ham toasty, yeah? Yeah. Anything no else? problem. What? Is that all for you? Um, Sorry, it's still deciding. No, it's all. Are you sure? Yeah. No, that's everything, thank you. Just make sure you don't get that. Thank you. Um, yesterday we were here and we got a cheese and ham toasty, but when we got home it was a sausage one. It was a sausage one? Yeah. So I think maybe the, someone else must have had a toasty at the same time and they'd give us someone else's and we'd gone home. Do you know what I mean? You ordered a cheese and ham toasty? Panini. Uh, panini. 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 And they give us the sausage panini and it must have been like a I think so. Oh, thank you. There you go, chops. Free toasty. Here's your panini. Free panini. Success is ours. Pretty sure you can get in the house all right, but I'm just making sure. Oh, itty. <laughs> I really want to go in and watch Christmas movies, but I just can't. Right, there we go. Is he in? Literally pulled on the drive to drop my brother off. He's, he's jumped out of the car, took two seconds, and there's already a van behind us. So I'm having to wait for this van to move so I can get off. Honestly, I wanted this to be a quick 10 minute thing. I bet I've missed the package as well while I'm out. 90s tunes! I want my coffee so bad. While I was at Costa, I had three business emails come through. I need to get home. We're gonna race. We're gonna race. 
We're not gonna race. I'm terrible. I've been out of the house five minutes. Five minutes! I haven't missed a package. It's all right though. It's round the side of the house. Imagine if it had been a like rearranged delivery one. I think I would have lost my mind. Anyway, I'm gonna go and get it because apparently, apparently it's somewhere outside. So I'm pretty sure yesterday, sat here if i remember rightly so i was saying that i'm a bit stressed because i'm working on something with a company at the minute and it's just not perfect i mean obviously it's not going to be perfect while you're making it like the process but i just you know what i'm like i stress and i was just worried that i was like oh my god like it's not right like it needs to be perfect and yeah the next version has come through and i love it like, i'm so much happier with it and um, i'm just changing a few more things on it because you know what i'm like like it has to be perfect so i'm just changing a few more things and then we'll have the final the final version then we can move on to samples oh god i can't wait for you guys to see this i am literally not saying anything though like, i am sworn to secrecy can't mention who it's with can't mention what it is all i can tell you is that i'm working on something with a company and when something gets released in February, you'll know what it is. I'm gonna go out to the garage in a second because I've got to make a load of Princess Rags orders. So I'm gonna be in there probably for the rest of the day now. I might have to come back in for a few things on the computer. But yeah, I'm just gonna do a few last emails and then we're gonna go out to the garage. Oh, I just went out to the garage to turn the heater on because I'm gonna be out there probably the rest of the night, like really late into the night. And while I was out there, I got my red and green shaker case. Yay! I was supposed to be saving it for Disneyland because I'm taking the pink one and the red and green one to Disneyland for Christmas. So I'm supposed to be saving it. The pink one is my absolute favourite. So I've, I thought I'm going to take the pink one off and use the red one for a while. Then I can have the pink one back on in Disneyland. Sounds crazy, doesn't it? I'm going to be using both of them. I think on Christmas Eve, I'm going to dress Pastly Christmas. I know the, the fact... Well, I think everybody thinks of outfits when they go to Disney. Or is it just me? Um, but I think on on Christmas Eve, I'm going to go pastel. I think I already know what I'm wearing. On Christmas Day, I'm going to go like traditional, like red. Hopefully a big white coat. So like red and white. See, when I think of red and white, if you live in the North East, you'll know what I mean. But I think of Sunderland and then black and white is Newcastle. But for Christmas, I'm going to go red and like fake white kind of fur. And possibly a touch of green. I don't know. So this is going to be my Christmas Day phone case. Red and green to match my outfit. Uh, so that one has a shaker on as well. I don't even know if I've shown you this one. Obviously, it's on the Princess Rags website. Did I even mention that? These are my phone cases on Princess Rags. And there's a blue one as well, but... Um, and I suppose I could use that one for Paris. I still don't know what I'm wearing for Disney. Or Paris, for that matter. Oh, anyway, I have just went out to the garage to turn the heating on. And while I was out there, I got this. But honestly, that heater is not big enough. I am freezing. Like, I need, a bit, I need to put a bigger coat on. It's absolutely freezing out there. My sister's coming down to do some of her business stuff in the garage in about an hour and we're both just going to work in the garage and she's going to regret it because she already thinks that my house is cold. She has the heating on, like, even over the summer, she had the heating on constantly. I don't understand it. Like, I don't like being cold, but I'm also not one for wasting electricity and money and the environment and all that sort of thing. So, yeah. I've got the heat on in the house and it's fine, but the garage is absolutely freezing, so I've left the heater on full blast for 10 minutes to hopefully make a difference. But anyway, I just thought I'd show you my red case. How cute is it? I absolutely love it, and it's got like the shaker in there. Matthew's just texted me that thing I was talking about earlier. I was saying that I'm working with a company on something, and he's just texted us and he's put, looks loads better, much more you. I can't wait to show you now, I'm so excited. I'm just going to do a bit more emailing and business and then I'm going out to the garage. And I think I'm going to go and try and get to the post office in about an hour or so. Just depends, but I am going to be in the garage for the rest of the night. I cannot for the life of me think when the last time I spoke to you was. I think it was quite a few hours ago it's quarter to 11. i came in the garage and started doing like work like princess rags orders you know on my sewing machine my sister came round matthew came home from work my sister came round my sister brought some chips from the fish and chip shop and she was here for about an hour and i was just kind of sat with her like back in the house yeah i came in i've just made a skirt well i've made a few things actually 
but I think I time lapsed making a skirt. And yeah, it's quarter to 11. I've just gone back in the house. Um, Matthew's in bed, obviously. He's not asleep though. He's still not getting up for work. He was late again today. And I think he was late yesterday as well. And also me and Matthew are in Manchester all day on Thursday. So I've like lost a whole day of doing orders. But Matthew is off on Friday. So on Friday and Saturday, he's going to help me do orders just kind of all day. And then hopefully if we just pile drive through all the orders together, hopefully we'll still have time to do that video that I really want us to do. Like on Saturday night or something, I don't know. So that is kind of what's going on. I'm just going to get on with some orders. How cool is this coat by the way? It's just Primark. Um, I love that. I've been, I, I remember when I bought it I felt really guilty because I was like I don't need another coat. I still need to do my black, black flight. Black Friday haul. Lord knows when I'm going to fit that in. I've got so many videos I just want to do, but I need to do these orders. So I'm going to get on with some work and yeah, get back to you guys in a bit, I guess. So it's now 26 minutes past one. I have done um, quite a few skirts. I've gotten quite a few done. I'm quite happy. Anyway, so I'm gonna go to bed. I think that's the best option now. I really don't think I'd have got very much done with you guys today at all, did I? Did I take my little brother out for a cost today? I literally can't remember anything. Like, it's been such a long day. Yeah, I had a good day work-wise. Like, I got so much work done. It was like on the computer as well. Like I'm really excited about some stuff happening. I'm excited about this business call tomorrow, but I'm just a bit nervous about it. I'm gonna get to bed. And yeah, sorry today was quite worky, but hopefully, and tomorrow's gonna be worky as well, but Thursday should be good because we're going to Manchester and Matthew's home on Friday and yeah, hopefully we'll get a load of orders out. I've got hairs for it and it'll pick up, but I just really need to like work. Anyway, I'm gonna stop laughing. Thank you for watching today's vlogmas. I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye guys.